To Rex Pines TV. I'm Danielle Santiago. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Wednesday, April 22nd, 2020. Now let's go to Jaden to see what's happening today in history. Thank you, Danielle. Today in history on April 22nd, 1970, Earth Day was observed yesterday for the first time coordinated by Dennis Hayes. Now let's go to Nathaniel to see what to do today if you're bored and stuck indoors. Thank you, Jaden. Hello, Pinterest family. Welcome to Things to Do if You're Bored. You know how you're always reading books? Well, now we got a way so that you can keep your place in those books. To, for today's activity, we're going to be creating these fun bookmarks. Here are the steps. First, take three sheets of paper, one brown, one green, and one blue. Fold the brown one in half diagonally, and after you've done that, fold the edges up to the top. Then fold them in. Then you have your base. After that, you take your blue one and cut out a square. Then you glue that in. After you've done that, take the green and cut out a shape of a turtle's head. Then cut out shapes of flippers. After that, you cut out eyeballs. You then decorate your shell and glue the head onto the turtle. Then add your eyes and use markers to put them on and glue them on using glue. Then draw a face on it. After you've done that, glue the clippers onto your turtle bookmark. Then do some extra decorations and then curve it at the top and the bottom. And now you have your turtle bookmark. First, take two sheets of paper, black one and the white one, cut a straight slit out of one, and cut a kind of circle-ish cut out of another one. Then make these shapes like macaronis for the arms, and get a template of Toothless's face. After you've done that, make sure that Toothless's face is bigger than the width of the bookmark. Then color in some eyes and cut them out and glue them onto your Toothless face. onto it but only glue the top part so it hugs the book then tape the arms onto it and draw a nose and some claws then you have your toothless bookmark make any necessary trims now you know how to make these radical bookmarks remember if you make one of these bookmarks Please send a picture or video of it to primes.renaissance at gmail.com and check in tomorrow for your next DIY. And remember, stay creative!
creative. Now let's go back to Danielle. Thank you, Nathaniel. Now let's go to Weather with Vani. Thank you, Danielle. Today's weather in Parapet, Florida is forecasted to be 90 degrees Fahrenheit and partly cloudy. Now, let's go back to Danielle. Thank you, Vani, and admin announcements. Teachers, please be on your emoto page to welcome your scholars in in the morning. Attendance must be taken at some point each day. And lastly, teachers, please don't forget to provide our scholars with positive hero points. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations. It represents, present yourself positively, act kindly toward others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Thank you. Congrats, Ms. Milholm, Mrs. Kuttner, Ms. Cavalita, Mr. Santiago, Ms. Samuel, Ms. Moraz, and Mrs. Santiago. You had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, is a scorpion a member of the arachnid family? The correct answer to the trivia question was yes. Now for today's trivia question. What is the name of the organ at the top of the snake's mouth? Once again, what is the name of the organ at the top of the snake's mouth? Teachers, please send your answers to highs.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish all of you a wonderful Wednesday. And remember, reset your mindset. Have a great day.